Hi everyone, it's Tiffany. I am here with the new Scruff Loves So Surprise. I want to thank the company so much for sending this to me for free to check out with you guys. Now Scruff Loves So Surprise lets you magically create the cutest fashionable outfits for your mystery pup or kitten. Rescue your matted ball of fur by giving them a bath, then dry, brush, and love them and you will discover what kind of pet they really are. Now create some fashionable clothes for your new pet using your magic sewing machine. Ooh. <laughs> there are 10 surprises to discover. Which fashion, fashion item will you reveal in the sewing machine? Will it be a skirt, shorts, bow, top? Add accessories like a watch and glasses. Customize and decorate your toe, toe Toe, toy a sewing machine with stickers. With the Scruff Love So Surprise, you will have the best dressed pet in town. So we get 10 surprises inside. I'm so excited to check this out. Oh my gosh. All right, let's see if anything fun is on the back. It is. So there's a sneak peek at the sewing machine. Um, I guess this is the puppy here. I'm not seeing an example of the kitty other than the doodle on the back here, like right here. But it's so cool, it looks like they have a little bit of fur on their head so you can style it. I think we're gonna go ahead and get this open so we can take a closer look at it. Now here is our matted ball of fur. It's starting to come apart a little bit, so I think we have a doggy right here, but I'm gonna go wash him and then we will reveal him. But let's check out the contents of the box. So we got our sewing machine, which is super awesome. I love this little mini sewing machine. So even when you're done with uh, with this project, you could use this for for your other dolls um, or playing pretend and all of that fun stuff. So this is going to be repurposed really nicely. We do have some drawers in here, which we're going to check out in a bit. So we do have some spools of fake thread. Uh, we can go ahead and pop them here on the top, I believe. They will stay like so. And we've got some glasses for our pet. And we've got a watch and a brush or a comb. And we have some sticker sheets, of course. We'll look at all of those cute sticker sheets. So these are some of the stickers we can stick in the watch. And then these we can put on the glasses. But the rest of them free to put anywhere. Well, you can put any of them anywhere, really. Now, we do have a booklet here, a style guide. Let's see what this, oh, this is a little folder. That's pretty cool. So, we have our repeat play. Let's see. Oh, goodness. So, number one, scruffy to fluffy. So, this is the same situation. We're just going to go ahead and take care of our little animal and see, um, See what they what they are. We're gonna dry them up, wash them, and then dry them up. So the stickers we can put all over our sewing machine, as you can see there, and place the ones on the watch. We already talked about that. Now we can reveal our fashion. So we pick a spool color, and each colored spool corresponds to each fashion item. So we select a spool. So let's just say this yellow one, and then we put it here. And then we place a spool on the spindle, turn clockwise to reveal the fashion. So we'll go ahead and open up drawer number one, okay. And then, so the reveal your fashion, which style? Uh, your complete outfit will include one headwear, one top, and one bottom. And then we have style and accessorize, which is nothing new, we'll figure that out as we go. And we have the using the play set, but we kind of already know how that goes. So this is what we have right here. We've got our outfit, we've got this, oops, has some Velcro on it. This is pretty cool. And we've got, oh, we have to go with the next one. So if we close it, can we close it back up? All right, let's get the pink one next. Ooh, all right. So we have a little shirt or a little jacket. Kind of looks like a little jacket. And we'll just close that back up. So I love this. I love how this drawer thing works. And then we have the purple spool. And we have a little skirt. That's so cute. I love the little skirt. It has little paw prints on it. This is my favorite. I don't like any other ones. This is my favorite. I'm just kidding. I like them, but this is my favorite. But anyway, we are going to... I lost my little ball of fluff. Here he is. We're going to go ahead and wash him and dry him. And we'll come back and we'll dress him. Surprise! Here's our little friend. We did not do any brushing, so we're looking a little rough. <laughs> but, 
but we did some washing and drying. So it kind of looks like he's a little um, crusty, I guess, but he's actually pretty soft. Uh, we could use quite a few hours of brushing though, if I do say so myself. I think I might use a better brush than this as well, but anyway, I just wanted to show you what he looks like after he's all washed and dried. Super cute, love his little embroidered paw prints. Now, of course, we have our lovely outfits that we can put on. I'm gonna put on this little dress on this little guy or gal or whatever. <laughs> this is the cutest thing ever. Look at the little dress. Oh my goodness, I love it. And I don't know if this is supposed to be a hat or if it's supposed to be a uh, collar, but I'm gonna say it's a hat. And then, of course, we have the sweatshirt to go with our skirt. And we're gonna put that on, one arm in, and let's get the other one in. Ah, hold on, let's see. All right, there we go. And then we'll go ahead and secure it here in the front with the Velcro. Oh, it's stuck on the skirt. All right, and there we have it. There's our little outfit. Oh my gosh, I love it. Oh, oh, we cannot forget the glasses too. Let's see here glasses. Also, I love how he has one blue eye and one green eye. That's so cute. I didn't know that was a thing and then I looked at the little sheet that I got, the little paper with the examples. There's like a purple one and a pink one that you can get. There's two. There's a purple cat and a purple dog and a, uh, a pink dog and a pink cat and they all have the different colored eyes which is awesome. Anyway, we also have a watch which I forgot to put the sticker on. Let's see, I don't know which one I want. I feel like this one. Well, no, I like digital. Honestly, I like digital clocks. <laughs> They're so much easier. Some people, some people don't even know how to tell time with the, the hand clocks these days, but I don't blame them. I always struggled with that my whole life. <laughs> anyway, we'll go ahead and squeeze his little paw in here. Look at this. Ready for a workout, if you ask me. I still don't know if this is, let me know if this is a hat or if this is a collar. <laughs> but anyway, that is it. This is our little friend. I love the little sewing machine. Like I said, even though the activity is pretty much done at this point, you could totally reuse this sewing machine for other pretend play. It's so awesome. I love it. We have our little friend, our dog, some stickers, and a brush. So cool. I want you guys to leave me a comment down below and let me know if you like dogs or cats better. <laughs> I can never pick personally, but if you have a favorite, let me know. I'm happy we got this little puppy. But anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.